Welcome to thetechnologycloset.com and our quick shots. In this quick shot, we're going to show you how to disable the first sign-in animation screens that uh, are part of adding a new user to your computer. In my particular case, I've had to add five users to my computer with a possible sixth one down the road. And I want to save myself some time when doing it by not having those screens pop up and speed up the uh, installation process. Let me show you what I mean. First, we're going to go to the charms bar. Select settings, change PC settings. Select accounts, other accounts. We're going to add a user. Now, I have a user here already. I'm going to add a new user. The first screen that pops up after hitting the add user is it requests an email address. We don't have one. Instead, I don't want one for my people to log in. I want them to just log in locally. Sign in without a Microsoft account. Now they say not recommended. Uh, user's choice. Select that particular item. Once you're in the add user screen, you can select local account. In this case, a new user. We're going to have Mia2. Again, with no password. Little reminder so that I know that. Next. Not a child, so I don't worry about the family safety. And finish. Close down the screen. And we're back to the start screen. Now, here's where those animations come in. I'm going to log off as administrator and sign in to Mia2. Sign in through this lock screen, select Mia2, and watch what happens. We have some animation screens popping up. This can delay the implementation of setting up the desktop. I like to speed this up. And now we're finally back to the start screen. And that took approximately a minute to a minute and a half, depending upon your computer system, to go through all that process just to come up to a brand new desktop for the new user, Mia2. Now we're going to delete this user and we're going to go make a change and show you that change and then we're going to add this user back in again just so you can see that the animation screens are no longer there. Now here at the start screen we're going to go back to our desktop and we're going to open up a program utility called GP Edit. Let's go to the desktop and right mouse click on the start button. Select Run Type in gpedit.msc in the open field and select OK. This will open up the editor. Now that we have the editor open, we're going to select Computer Configuration on the left hand side, Administrative Templates, System, we're going to expand that one. From the system selection, we're going to scroll down till we see log on. From the log on screen, we've selected it. On the right hand side of the screen, you will see some selections. One of the selections we want is show first sign in animation. Double click on that. That'll bring up the sign on animation screen. It's not configured. We want to enable it. By doing so, that will prevent those screens from coming up. Select Enable, select Apply, select OK, and close down the GP Editor. That's it. Now the next time you add a user, you'll go from adding the user to the Start screen without having to see all of those other screens that come up, and it will save some time. Well, that's it for this quick shot. Please visit our website at thetechnologycloset.com. And while you're there, check out our YouTube channel. Until next time.